welcome back to my channel hope you guys are doing wonderful my name is Nisha and I love fragrances if you're new here please consider subscribing and if you're my old subbies thank you guys today we have a house review from the house of Avi Laurent yes I practice saying that Avi Laurent and this company reached out to me since the probably mid last year and they sent me some fragrances and I wanted to play with them before I could come to you and give you my thoughts. Now there's a long story and I need to say this. When I tell you customer service is the best that I have seen, that I have witnessed in my life, no lie. They sent me one fragrance, that was fine. Then the, that fragrance, I was not in love with it, so I told them, you know, and they sent me a bunch of samples. So I told them, you know, the one that you sent me, I'm not a fan of it, but I really like some of the ones that you sent as samples. So I told them which one and they were so generous that they sent me a package with like five fragrances in it. Funny story is though, they made an error with my address and they changed the number a bit. So that package was not delivered to me. Now they were on it, man. When I told them they were so apologetic and they were so generous that they shipped out another package with these fragrances. And guys, these are very very expensive fragrances very luxurious okay when you go on the website you'll see what i'm talking about the price is very up there now this took a while they sent it out and for some reason customs took my package i could not believe this i'm like no this is not happening so another stumbling block customs took my package so again i didn't get it can you imagine these people were so, so generous to send me another package? Like seriously, who does that? And these fragrances, I'm talking about like five fragrances in one box. Finally, after all that, I got my package. Finally. Guys, I was so impressed with this customer service. As soon as I emailed this company, trust me, in less than 15 minutes, I would get a reply. I will get a response. This is unheard of. Like, I am so impressed. Avi Laurent, I, if you're looking, I am so, so grateful for your generosity. And I am thankful. So guys, before I... St let me stop rambling on here and get into the products. Now, I'm going to insert a picture how the fragrance comes. Like the packaging. Now, this is a very, very luxurious house. And it is very, very pricey. Now... I'm going to be honest with you guys, the packaging, I think they could work on the packaging. Now it's simple packaging, but the box and all that, it's very, very simple. Considering the price that you pay for this, they could work on the packaging. But this is a very new-ish niche brand. So they're getting there, they're tweaking it, you know, they're listening to um, feedback. So I'm sure they're going to improve stuff. Guys, Avi Laurent. Now let me show you some of the packaging. Now it's very simple packaging. The box is very simple. The fragrances come in like very simple, sleek packaging. So this is what they look like. And there's some of them that comes in the slimmer, taller bot bottles. Now these fragrances, there's, when you go on the website, it could be a little bit overwhelming. There's so many different, um, how to put it, so many different categories that you can choose from. So it could be a little bit overwhelming, but I was really, really happy with the ones that I chose. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys, not because they sent me these fragrances. I'm going to tell you, oh, I love them. The first one they sent me, I was not a fan of. Now, it was pretty. Well, actually, I was holding it in my hand. This one is Pink Palace. It's a very pretty fragrance, but it was not my style. This one is very floral. It's like... It's very feminine, it's very dainty. This fragrance, as I said, it's like a fresh bouquet of flowers. You can smell the natural flowers in these fragrances. Now, these are made with very, very high quality ingredients. And as I said, these are very, very pricey. I will try to put up the prices of these fragrances on the screen as we go along, but just know they're very, very luxurious. <laughs> So this one is called Pink Palace and diamonds are forever. That's what it says. As I said, it's very simple, but this one was not my cup of tea. So I told them, I said, thank you for your gift. But this one is not my style. No, it's not a bad fragrance. Do not get me wrong. 
it is a beautiful fragrance for the person that loves like white florals and all that but because I am not that type this one was not my vibe so but still get your nose on it if you can sample it I don't know if they do samples I'm not sure but this one is like a fresh bouquet of flowers it's like you're naturally smelling the flowers in this so this one is pink palace let me move on to another one we'll move on to lady how you pronounce this Vari, v r e i lady vi i don't know i don't want to butcher the people's name this is what it looks like this is the name okay now this one out of all the fragrances that i got this one is a beast okay i remember spraying this and hugging a friend of mine's and she could smell this on her skin long after she's like whatever you're wearing it's all over me and it smells amazing guys this is so so strong this is oh child this one is my husband's favorite he loves he's like oh my god what is that what is that i'm like hold up let me tell you so it's a burst of citrus in the beginning as i said it's very strong the top notes are vanilla it has oak musk apple um it has dark uh, oak vetiver again i don't pick up those notes it has red rose yes i get that moroccan jasmine the dried on it has birch patchouli black black currant uh red grapefruit red grapefruit and in the base we have bergamot tea rose gardenia spice clove tobacco amber sandalwood now you see here in tobacco amber sandalwood and all that you think is a nice no it's not heavy like that i don't pick up those notes at all so there's a lot of notes that is in here that my nose do not pick up to me this is i get the rose i get the vanilla i get the freshness of the apple it's a very citrusy floral kind of fragrance but when i tell you these fragrances are unique they are so unique it's not your run of the mill fragrances not everybody is going to like these i'm being i'm putting that out there these are very classy these are very ladylike as i said these are very signature scent worthy fragrances these are quite different to me honestly it's quite different to my liking but by wearing these fragrances and learning to enjoy them and enjoying the beauty of them i really enjoy wearing them as i said these two that i spoke about the three that i spoke about so far they're all summery to me they're all summery i haven't really gotten one that's winterish like so let's move on to the other one so the other one so this other one is called obscene again in the same plain box and this is what it looks like i like the bottles for that i like the bottles i don't like the box obscene this is very different again this is very minty i wrote my notes because trust me there was so much to go through i may have forgotten i have it's very minty it feels it's fresh and i could pick up cedar in this so this has cedar the top notes has mint apple greenberry plum cedar wood the heart notes are tea rose orange flower vanilla patchouli amber and cinnamon and the base notes are tonka musk bergamot agarwood olive danum and labdanum i pick up the mint in this as i said and the cedar i pick up the cedar wood but it's not very heavy as i said these fragrances are very well blended this one is so unique i really like this one this is a nice everyday scent it's very inoffensive these that i'm talking about not the two round bottles these two round bottles i wouldn't recommend them for work because i find they're very strong and potent but like these the square ones that i'm telling you i'll mention it as i go along these are very nice fragrances for the office it's very office appropriate it's not going to offend anyone and as i said these are like really nice signature scent woody fragrances this i have never again have anything in my collection that smells like this this is really pretty so again this is called obscene hmm she's kind of obscene okay moving on to the other one this other one i think it's one of their new releases and i love this this is a beautiful one for the summertime oh my god it's so so pretty this one retails for i'm on your website now this one is 280 dollars okay the other ones were more some were a little bit less this has top notes of pear peach ginger apple and marigold the base notes are plum petals le petal leaves 
crushed currant, jasmine, and apple blossom, and the base notes of vanilla, orchid, sandalwood, and coconut milk. This is so pretty. It's so juicy. The name is right. See how they pronounce? They spelt it. It's kind of cheeky. It says juicy peach. It is so juicy. You get the bunch of like the fruits in the opening with those um vanilla and you get that little bit of sandalwood in the base this is so pretty my daughter smelled it she's like mom i'm taking it i'm like hell no you're not you can use it when you want it's so pretty it's so juicy it's so fresh it's bright it it's effervescent i think in all of them the two these two here where is it let me find it these two are very elegant and very classy lady i see like a like those ceo woman wearing this this is like a boss lady kind of scent very signature scent worthy kind of thing as i said it's not for the younger crowd i think this is more for the mature woman boss woman woman who knows what they want you know what i mean that kind of woman woman in charge not no juvenile kind of thing so these are like that this one is more for the younger ones i think young people would love this this is very beautiful no it's not juvenile don't get me wrong but it's so beautiful it's so fresh it's so fruity it's so playful so i really really love this peachy one so it's called um juicy peach so guys this is just a little bit on this house as i said they were very very generous to me because they sent me one and i told them i'm saying like i haven't reviewed it because it's not my favorite it's not my type of fragrance not that it's a bad fragrance but it's not my vibe and they're like sure tell us which one you like and we'll send it to you and these people as i said they sent three times and i lost like the mail lost two it wasn't my fault but i finally got it and i'm so grateful avi laurent i am so impressed with your customer service and i am so grateful for your generosity this brand as i said you don't hear much about it at all but who knows they know okay it's one of those very very luxurious very pricey as I said, the fragrances are very nice, very different to my taste, but I have learned to enjoy the beauty of these fragrances. Again, the packaging, mm, you guys could work on the packaging a little bit, but as I said, it's a new niche house, and listen, they're, they're getting in there, you know, they, they, they'll take criticism and try to better stuff, I hope. So guys, this is my thoughts on these fragrances. Please check them out. I would leave their link in the description. As I said, it could be a little tricky with the website, but have patience, you know, because there are different categories that you could go in to find these fragrances. I would also list the name of the fragrances that I spoke about, so that way you could type it in and you'll it'll come up easily for you, right? So again, thank you guys for watching, and I hope you take the opportunity to go and really check this house out you know give them a chance sample stuff because it's very expensive if you can sample it sample it and again to Javi Laurent thank you so much for your generosity and guys until next video be safe be kind and smell fabulous bye now